Hey guys, it's Evangelina and today we're in Feather Family. So today we're going to be looking at the new stalk. So um, this has actually just recently come out so I'm super excited but just before we get into it, um, I would like to say please leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Let's get into it. Okay, so I'm going to go into the lockables tab and we're going to go down. So uh, it actually it's 400 feathers but I kind of bought it before. Now I've seen, I've seen the heaps of comments and like, how did you get feathers? You can't buy them. But actually, the way I got these is I used to be addicted to this game. Like I would sit there all the time. It's really just living your device. Since Feather Family gives you um, feathers um, every like few minutes, I, but something like that. Uh, if you leave your device on on for long enough, you get enough feathers. All right, let's get into it. So 400 feathers, and it's gone hatchling and adult now. I would just like to say this. Actually, I've been seeing a lot of actually male female birds. Like um that have two different um, genders for the adult. A good example of that is the Nightjar, which actually has a female and a male. Uh, I think there's other birds. Oh, actually, maybe that's the first. I don't know. Hmm. No. Oh, uh, but yeah, so maybe that I'm actually wrong, but I really enjoy seeing this male-female sort of birds, but it's only if a bird actually has two genders. Okay, let's go ahead and have a look at the hatchling. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, we're very cute. <laughs> Um, sorry, I can't say these are right because I got like an expander and like I'm actually physically unable to talk. Expander and braces actually. And like, uh, it's gonna sound really embarrassing, but I can't say the letter C. Like, nose and C is in like cat, kit. <laughs> in the word like kit. C U T E, kit. <laughs> I'm sorry, I actually can't speak. Let's have a look, there we go. Let's play. Okie dokie, here we are as a little stalky walky. Sorry, that sounded really weird as a stalk. Um, there we go. Okay, we're very small. Actually, no, we're quite large. Hold on, there's an enemy. Let's let's get in comparison as we always do. And also, this is a sprint. Oh, actually, we're fairly big as an adult enemy. And this is the normal walk. There's that. Let's actually let's go back here. This seems nice. This area. Well, it actually does spawn in the desert, so it's a desert spawn bird. But let's have a look. So first, we need to have a look at the jump, jump, jump. There we go. Now let's have a look at the call. Uh, I do need to put my volume up. So there's that. Ah, uh, let's have a look at sit chicken squat. We love it. It's amazing. We love it. Ah, uh, let's have a look at the eating. Sorry. Then we have hurt and eyes. Open, closed. I think we should go to somewhere else to go adulty so let's go sanctuary because it's really nice over here now i just want to say this place i don't know this is really random but this place brings me so much nostalgia because um i played from like probably the 2019 time period to now which is what three four three four four years four years i'm sorry i actually can't count i feel like i'm dumb <laughs> It's actually four years, so um, I was here when this game kind of just popped up on co popularity. I was here when this place wasn't even built. There, there was no sanctuary, so I feel like actually bringing in the sanctuary had a big influx of people coming in to play. But um, it, it used to look different. This is so nice. Actually, let me just have a little explore before we get here, but it's really nice, honestly. I like what they did with the place, but I was here when, like, you came in and there was only, like, a little bed and, like, um... There was no this room. This room wasn't here. This was it. This whole area was it. And there was one little med bed here. And I think there was more med beds and water bottles. Water bottles? Water bottles over here. Okay, so let me have a little look at this. So, let's go ahead and grow up. Yes, and we'll keep our colours. Just to show you if you don't have, uh, if you want bothered to colour or you don't want to colour. Oh, okay, so we're pretty big. Okay. Let's have a look at the call first, because that is necessary. There we go, my dudes. And go. Okay. Let's go, besties. Whoop. Okay, that's nice. I like it. I like it. Okay. I actually like it. It's nice. Let's have a look at the normal walk. Oh my gosh, this little thing wobbles. I don't know what you call it. It's probably a nice scientific name. We're just going to call it the wobbler. The wobbler wobbles. <laughs> Okay, let's have a look at the sprint version. So a much quicker wobbler. And um, we kind of move more. Nice. Okay. Jump. Okay, so we actually kind of go in the air. Now, big lift up. Alright, let's try sit. 
chicken squat. Oh, those are some weird legs, my guy. That's an a right angle, right angle, square. There you go, some math for you. <laughs> I don't even know. Right angle square. Let's have a look at the eight. There's that. So if you're slow, this place is so pretty. Let's actually go in here for a bit. It gives me like mystical, mystical mushroom roleplay vibes. I don't even know why. Oh, that is so pretty. Hold on, thumbnail. Thumbnail, hold on. Ah, uh, okay, so let's go hurt. I'm very interested. Oh my gosh, it's like bike yoga. That's what it is. Okay, interesting. There's hurt. Now let's try display. We're kind of okay. The 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 the. the oh my gosh! I should tell a story right now. When um, me and my friend we went on a trip together one time, and basically there was this pelican thing. And you know how pelicans like they really have a strong bite force. So if you bite you, if you bite them, they hurt. I had the stupidest idea to go ahead and you know try and feed it a chip. Um, it kind of I was feeding other birds chips actually. And the pelican waddled in and decided to uh, bite my whole hand, bite my hand off with the chip. So not only did the chip got taken, but my hand also got bitten. That was some scary stuff, dude. Like I ran, I was crying. Like I hate bugs and big birds. They're very scary, you know. That was like an encounter, you know. I mean, that was scary. Trauma. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's try preying now. There's our preying. Seven eyes open, closed. And fly. I didn't know storks could fly. <gasps> no, they can because there's the baby delivering birds. Yeah, I'm a genius. I know, right? <gasps> I just realized. You know how storks have the little wobble gobble thing? That's why they're called the baby delivering things. Because they hold it there. Am I right? I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. <laughs> but there's that. Okay. Uh, let me just create a nest and let's do it there. Okay, and let's color it. I think I like this. That's nice. Very nice. Okay, there we go. Okay, the, the nest is nice. I think it matches the bird quite nicely. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want more videos like this, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe on my channel for more videos like this. And also, the hawk is coming out very soon, so I will really be excited to share that with you but until i see you guys next time goodbye love you gamers besties